Civil War. Show me something that will shorten the Civil War and, and we'll buy it or whatever. Or, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll at least we'll get a good look at it. So once a month or so, these uh, tinklers come up to the back door of the White House and they have all these different inventions, you know, steel plates and helmets and you know, all kind of poison things and dots and all kinds of stuff. But some good stuff came out of this. The, uh, the, the six-shooter was can, can be attributed to Lincoln inviting these inv inventors up. Dry gunpowder could be attributed to drier gunpowder, better gunpowder, uh, 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 can be attributed to Lincoln and his, his uh, asking these people to come up. Uh, the blimp, you know, the first, uh, this, well, we won't say the first, but this uh, light and air balloon with helium or hydrogen. Uh, the Gatlin gun. And and uh, using uh, the, the the teletype and, and 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 using trains to to move troops rather than march and get there faster and fresher and all this stuff. And uh, but, but you know, <laughs> one thing that uh, a tinker came up and showed Lincoln was a water shoe. Now I, I didn't believe that, but if you look at the book, the war, uh, the Civil War, the Civil War, the big book, the Civil War. On page, uh, I think it's 130 on the right hand side. You know, they got two pictures, two little skinny guys there, whatever, on the right hand side, and they use the term water shoe. Uh, they, some kind of inventor came up and showed Lincoln and demonstrated the water shoe to Abraham Lincoln. And we've already said that uh, Herman Hobbs, who was one of Lincoln's generals, Herman Hobbs. It was one of Lincoln's generals, and he also had war shoes. So that's two, that's two shots. In the Civil War, that the water shoe was exposed to Abraham Lincoln, Father Abraham, and, uh, in the Civil War.